you're my parents, then you're not, and now you are again? Y'all need to stop being around the bush and tell me and Dee exactly what's going on right now. How can you not be her parents but be her flesh and blood? Because they're not her parents. They're her grandparents. Destiny, I'm your father. What is he talking of? Oh, baby. Oh, sweetheart. It doesn't change what's in our hearts. You are our baby girl. And we love you the same way we always have. You're not my parents. No, honey, no. We, we, we're not your parents. We're your grandparents. You didn't know about this? No, Destiny, I didn't. It means you're not my brother anymore. But what we mean to each other, that doesn't change. Never. And it never will. Never. All this time, I didn't know who my own father was. How did that happen? I was just about to start med school. A girl I was seeing got pregnant. And neither one of us thought that we were in a position to take care of a baby. So, Greg came to us for help. And me being a social worker, he thought I'd be able to place the baby with a good family. But honey, once we saw you, there was no way on God's green earth that we would ever, ever give you up. We always wanted a little girl. Yes, and you have been such a gift to us, more than anyone could deserve, baby. Please just try to understand. Here's what I understand. Greg is my father, and he was going to give me to strangers. Oh, no, don't say that. Why not? That's what happened, right? No. <laughs> you took me in, and you lied to me. All three of you lied to me my entire life. <laughs> Listen, we are still a family. Mm -hmm. We all still love each You're other. You're not supposed to lie to the people you love. How could you let her think you were her parents all these years? And you. You just had to stay on that doctor track. You couldn't let anything get in the way. Not even your own kid. Look, I wanted her to have two loving parents. I thought I was doing what was best for her. And this is what Eli Clark was holding over your head. That you had a kid that you never claimed. Uh, no, Sean, uh, that's not fair. Let's talk to Destiny about what's not fair. Growing up not knowing where she came from, is that fair? Eli Clark was going to make you look bad. So you let him ruin how many lives? No, it's not that cut and dried. How about you tell us? Stop! Who is my mother? My real one. I think I deserve to know that much. I need to know who you're looking for what. It wasn't going to last. I don't last. care. Who was she? What's wrong with you people? It's a simple question. She was a girl from the overhood. And when she gave Destiny up, her, her life path, it changed. She, she just moved on. Are you telling me you let Greg turn his back on a neighborhood girl? Just so he could put that diploma on his wall? You, you don't understand. Then Greg needs to make me understand. You took orders from a murderer. Why? It can't be just because you got your girlfriend pregnant. Of course not. There's more to it than that. So spit it out! Who's the girlfriend? But that's just it. She was my girlfriend. What does that mean? She was Sean's. Your mother was a girl that Sean was in love with. Charlie, you and Charlie, it came out of nowhere. I mean, we never met. Look, Sean, you were in prison, and Charlene and I have been working together on your appeal. That was real hard work, wasn't it? How could you do that to your own brother? I'm so sorry. Look, it never should have happened. But because it did, destiny happened. 
and you, baby, were our gift. Our beautiful baby girl. The girl Charlene didn't want. Right, it wasn't you she didn't want, Destiny. And I know for a fact she couldn't stand the thought of hurting Sean. Now that just brings tears to my eyes. No, it's true, Sean. Charlene promised she'd wait for me. I loved her. I know. And I swear to you, I don't think she ever stopped loving you. Don't insult me, Greg. Well, I'm trying to be honest with you. Damn, Greg. You could have had any girl you ever wanted. Any girl. But you had to have mine. Why is that? Why do you always have to take from me just to prove that you can? I wasn't thinking of it like that. I wasn't thinking, period, and, and there's no excuse, okay? It was wrong. Oh, yeah. Just as wrong as you're getting her pregnant and lying about it. You selfish Sean, 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 no! Stop it! Stop it! No! Stop it! No! Stop it! Sean! Have you lost your mind? Not in front of your sister. Don't you mean my niece? I want to know where Charlene is now, honey. I told you. She I want to hear it from Greg. Where is she? She ran off. Ran off? When I got up, I tried like hell to find her. Well, maybe she wanted to disappear. No! Look, it's time for the truth. Haven't we had enough truth for one day? Look, I was trying to protect you. That's why I couldn't tell you. Where is she, Greg? What happened to my mother? Charlene is dead. I am so sorry. Just... This. I'll talk to her. No. You've told her enough lies. I'll go. Sean, we didn't know about Charlene. Gregory never said anything. I was trying to protect you. You were trying to cover your own sorry ass. that Charlene was dead. Why would you make up a story about her running off? Don't you see? Elijah Clark wasn't just threatening to tell the truth about destiny. He was going to tell the truth about Charlene. How she died. Well, how did she die? I killed her. <laughs>